going to be long before we're we're off for the summer break. So we've got to make the most of these last few practices and then uh, make the most of our time away this summer. Hey, everybody. Maria Martin with your sports. The Falcons are in the final week of OTAs, which means we have one more week to go until practice ramps up a little bit. The drills get a little more intense, yet there's still no live contact in mandatory minicamp next week. OTAs, however, are what head coach Raheem Morris calls the laying the foundation process, and he feels pretty good about where his guys are. The process of taking it from the classroom, taking it out to the grass, being able to go execute it, um, seeing the adjustments, seeing the people react, um, both offense, defensively, and special teams, being able to teach certain concepts, uh, full team concepts like shoot awareness when it comes to tackling, how we want to get people on the ground, um, a little bit about finish, uh, being able to talk about some of those things, and obviously um, absent of the physicality. When we get back to training camp, we'll, we'll have a nice physical camp and it should be a lot of fun for all of us to be able to watch. Quarterback Kirk Cousins now has a really good sample size of time with this team, and he likes where things are and where they are going. He also had an early impact on locker mate Bijan Robinson, who will be fully ready to go from an ankle injury come into Tory minicamp next week. I don't think I've really had somebody like really like sit down and tell me, you know, what to do and how to do it because I'm already I'm already like trying to out outsmart everybody. Um, but really listening to him and really just taking all the information and, and feedback that he has for me, you know, I, I take that serious and I really appreciate him for that. Tanning the ball off to him, you know, you could see the movement skills. I just appreciate his positive approach. Um, he's going to be the same guy every day. He's not going to ride the roller coaster. Uh, and, and who that guy is going to be a positive person who's always looking to the next play. And uh, um, he's an encouraging teammate.